Today we're going to be discussing using Mobile Center with UFT. So let's hop right in. Here we have the initial screen when we start UFT. If you'll notice that we do have mobile checked and we also have web, I do highlight or do recommend that you use this on startup every single time unless what you are using is more of a legacy and more static in nature. So let's hop right in. I'm just going to use this test. It's a blank test I just created. I'm going to get, walk you through the steps of initially connecting Mobile Center to UFT as well as how the settings need to be to actually be recording our UFT script. So the first thing we need to do is connect Mobile Center to UFT. You do that through the Tools, Options, GUI Testing, Mobile. And these are your settings for the Mobile Center server. We can test connection, verify that it does indeed work. Click OK. So we know we're connected there. Next thing we have to do is go to our record and run settings here. Now, click open the following record. Use Mobile Center. And use the URL. We're just going to go to Amazon. I'm going to select the device here. And devices here, save and close. I'm going to click apply. Now you can have other applications or test options. However, we're not going to be doing that. I will like to, I would like to mention something. The the view again. This is UFT 14. Here is a little bit different, but how it's used is essentially at its core the same. Also, I'd like to make sure that. Even though you're testing a mobile device, you're actually testing a web on a mobile device. So this is where you would create the, um, the settings for your run record. If you try to record a web device from here, your script will not work correctly. So I'm going to click Apply. And I'll click OK. Now I'm going to go into our record, and it should populate or open the our mobile device as well as Amazon. All right, here we go. It's opening. There we go. We're on Amazon. I am just going to, and now this is an actual physical phone that we're testing against. I'm just going to search 4K TV. Click search. Now when you click search, it should populate a number right here showing that it's actually recording our user action, which it is. I'm going to click this TV. And there we go. Now again, this is on a mobile device, but we can use all the tools of Mobile Center, or excuse me, UFT. We can use Object Spy and grab different things on the page. So let's grab I don't know, let's grab this. So we can then see, verify that it does indeed grab the Amazon. It does. We can add that if we want. We can go down to the price here and grab the price and use that as a checkpoint, however you want to do it. So all the, the normal ways that we script inside of UFT work when using UFT with Mobile Center. So let's go back and actually look at our script. Here we are. This is our script. You'll notice that the script looks essentially the same as traditional web script. And that's for good reason. We're just using the web on the mobile device. So all the traditional things that we use, you know, the make pass, uh, make fail, we can use here. We can use, you know, variables and parameters and all of the traditional UFT things that we can use, we can use those with Mobile Center. So again, my name is Josh Bryan with BNB. If you have any questions about this video or any of our other videos, feel free to reach out. You can reach me at info at Thanks again for watching. Bye.